All right, it's the ultimate costume party. Last night was the Met Gala, and no surprise here, A-listers let loose with their fashion choices, good and bad. But one thing is for sure, Rihanna reclaimed her crown as Met Ball Queen. Rihanna, big smile, big smile, Rihanna! Rihanna wins again. The star outdid everyone on the Met Gala's blue carpet in a come de garçon creation that was on theme for the evening. The night was dedicated to the Japanese label. The layered creation was an architectural marvel, as was Riri's ability to move so gracefully in the voluminous look. A close second for the title of showstopper, Katy Perry, the lady in avant-garde red. Katie, come on down. Perry, who is one of the event's co-chairs this year, wore a daring gown by Maison Martin Margiela, but let's talk about that veil and headpiece. The Bon Appetit singer sure knows how to serve up a wacky look. Speaking of wacky, how about this? Perry's fellow co-chair, Pharrell Williams' wife, Helen, in a tomato red armless onesie, which was also designed by the Knight's Honorary label. Online, it's being compared to the red chair from Blue's Clues. Meanwhile, the award for most nude goes to Kendall Jenner, whose slinky la perla haute couture dress left little to the imagination. Jenner's fellow model, Bella Hadid, also pulled off a revealing look with a Catwoman-esque jumpsuit by Alexander Wang. Now, last year, Hadid hit the red carpet with The weekend. This year, he was back too, but with his new love, Selena Gomez. Speaking of red hot couples, how's this one? Jennifer Lopez and her new beau, Alex Rodriguez, also made their first red carpet appearance together. And competing for the Fashion Proms King and Queen title, Ryan Reynolds and Blake Lively. The actress paired her embellished feathered gown with over $3.5 million in jewelry. You might be wondering, what about Kim Kardashian West, another Met Gala staple? Well, she was there in a simple, understated gown by Vivian Westwood. It's the new Kim K, y'all. And trust dynamic duo Katie Holmes and Zach Posen to pull off another stellar Met Gala look. The actress stunned in an off-the-shoulder gown designed by her good friend. Some other honorable mentions, Celine Dion in custom Versace, Madonna in camo Moschino looking ready for battle, twinning fashion queens Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen looking boho chic as always, and last but not least, Jaden Smith in Louis Vuitton, which he accessorized with his recently cut-off dreads. Let us know what you thought of last night's looks. Tweet us at NCity. From red carpet glamour to red band humor with Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> yeah, we can't tell you what they were talking about. It was inevitable. We all know Gottfried's brand of blue jokes. Here's what we can show you. The two discussing Gilbert, a new documentary in which the very private comic allows cameras into his life off stage and behind his trademark persona. Does it feel like you live two lives? The Gilbert on stage who is outrageous and blue and like dirty, dirty, dirty on stage. Yes. And your other life of family and uh, wife and kids. It, it, it is. It really is that scene in Wizard of Oz uh, where they pull back the curtain on the wizard and then he's just some guy. Thanks, Terry. And coming up tomorrow on Entertainment City, highlights from tonight's King Arthur red carpet.